Hello boys and girls, did you miss me? Well I thought we'd kick off 2018 with a bang! Giggity. In this video I'm going to be telling you how to make your eye red like you have pink eye, or how to make your eyes red like you're high, or how to make your eye red like you just motorboated Tinkerbell, which I guess afterwards you could call yourself Pinkerbell. Queries of the interweb. A couple things I want to say first is I want to thank you guys for helping me break 5,000 subs, which is a pretty significant milestone, but not really. And I also want to thank the following peeps for giving me inspiration for this video. You guys will go down in the Hall of Fame. Maybe, I don't know. So I'm going to explain four ways that you guys can make your eyes red. It's very important that you do not touch your eyeballs, okay? We're not irritating your eyeballs directly. Everything I'm showing you should be able to be done without hurting your eyes. Do not use anything like mace or pepper spray or, or like actual pepper, any strong irritants. Stay away from those. I don't want angry emails from your mom saying, my child's blind now because of your video. I don't need that. Neither do you. So the first way to make your eye red is to rub onion directly below your eyeball. Not on your eyeball, not above it, right here, okay? Take a piece of onion and rub it right here. This is going to cause constant exposure to the onion odor. You know how when you cut onions you cry? Here you're gonna be putting the onion odor directly below your eye so that your eye is getting constant exposure to that odor. That's going to make your eye turn red. If it gets too discomforting or you're, you're crying too much or whatever, go ahead and clean it off. The second way to make your eye red is to go swimming without goggles. That chlorine can F up your eye, bruh. Most people do this anyway, but you'll notice that a lot of times when you come out of the swimming pool after swimming for a while, your eyes are a little bloodshot. Go underwater in the swimming pool and just keep those eyes open. <laughs> There's usually not any serious damage as a result of this, but if you stay underwater long enough, your eyes will turn red. A third way you can make your eye red is sleep deprivation. You'll notice that a lot of people who don't sleep have blood red eyes because they've just been staring at their computer screen for eight hours. So when you go to bed, instead of falling asleep, whip out your iPad or your iPhone or your eye device, whatever the hell screen you have, and just watch South Park for eight hours. Or whatever you're into. Keeping up with the cool Coolidge's or the car, whatever, the Carmenians, I don't know. Now this method takes a little longer because obviously you just have to not sleep for a while. But if you got the time and you don't mind hating yourself in the morning, then yeah, go ahead and don't sleep. This fourth and final way I'll show you how to make your eye red without it hurting is dry out your eye. Dry eyes are a recipe for red eyes. How do you dry out your eye? Don't blink. Go as long as you can without blinking, just like... When it starts to get uncomfortable, you'll obviously have to blink, but if you keep doing this, your eyes will turn red. And Tinkerbell will thank you, because now you don't have to go to her. And she can keep the name Tinkerbell, instead of Pinkerbell. Ugh. Now you know four ways to make your eyes red. Thank you so much for helping me break 5,000 subs, guys. It's so cool. I'm seeing my channel grow every day, and I'm only uploading one video every week, every other week. I want to be more consistent, guys. If you share my videos, if I'm getting a lot of viewers and a lot of subs, I'm going to be like, yo, I need to upload more frequently, bro. Thanks for those who are still subscribed since the beginning. Have a fantastic year, guys. It's going to be epic. It might be mediocre, too, and you need to be prepared for that. Peace!